Hey, what's up guys, and welcome back to another Locked in Lego video, where after about three months of not posting anything, I'm finally coming at you guys with the Your Questions Answered, which you guys put in the question video, which was, like I said, about three months ago. And uh, before we get into this video, I'm just going to take a few minutes and explain uh, what's what I've been doing all the time and what I've been up to. I know most of you guys probably don't care. I know I uh, don't really like watching other people's update videos. But for those of you uh, who do care, I feel like I owe you some sort of explanation for where I've been on this time. And basically what happened about three months ago, I was finishing up with school and I got really, really busy. I just couldn't, I just didn't have time to make like any new videos and I felt super bad about that. And then, so that happened, then school ended about a month and a half ago for me. And I actually finished making this video and then my computer crashed. So I lost that video, I lost uh, like a lot of stuff on my computer, and I was just so upset about that that I didn't feel like making any new videos for a while, and also I had to, you know, kind of wait and save up uh, money for a good opportunity to buy a new computer. And so finally, three months later, here I am, I got a, I'm getting a new computer pretty soon right now, I'm actually uh, recording this on someone else's computer that they lent to me, and so basically that explains what's happened for the last three months. Um, if you guys care at all, um, but most of you probably just are here for the video. So we'll get into that in just one second. I just want to let you guys know that I am still alive. I'm not dead or anything. <laughs> and um, I'm excited to be back for the summer, and I've got a number of uh, new videos planned. I've got some more Clone Army Cousins hauls, some openings, and probably some more building challenges along the way. So don't be surprised if I s upload like maybe several times a week. I don't know. We'll see how the summer goes. But uh, yeah, I've got some big plans, and I'm still around. And uh, thank you to all the guys who've continued to give me some uh, support over the summer. Thank you guys for like not unsubscribing or whatever. Um, I really do appreciate it, and thanks for like uh, bearing with me while I had like to go through all that uh, uh, annoying stuff. And so I just want to thank you guys for sticking with me, and uh, hope you guys are excited for the new content I have later. So. Sorry, got all that out of the way now. Now we can get onto the actual video, and it's probably gonna already be longer than I want it to be. But uh, without further ado, um, I'm gonna answer all you guys' questions that you guys asked about uh, three months ago. Uh, so the first question comes to us from Noah Pixel. Uh, he says, "What is your least favorite figure on the CAC website besides the Mark and Orbital figures?" And I have to say, probably the first order troopers that he made, including like the Captain Phasma and the Heavy Trooper. I just don't think they look that good compared to Legos, and uh, I would never want to buy them. And he says, uh, which Legion is your favorite? His is the 212, that's pretty cool. And my favorite is obviously the 501st, because they're the best, objectively. Um, next we have five questions from uh, Green Ninja. Uh, do you know, if, I'm assuming that means, do you know a fake uh, Lego company that has good quality? No. Um, Mega Blocks, I mean, that's not really fake Lego, they have like they're their own thing, and I personally don't have a problem with them. I actually kind of like Mega Blocks, or Mega Constructs is what they call themselves now. Uh, what software do you use to edit and make your videos? I'm old school, and I don't know how to use a lot of this fancy stuff, so I use uh, uh, Windows Movie Maker still, which is w really outdated, but it works for me. Um, what is your favorite Lego droid? I don't really have one, um, but uh, as you can see the picture on here of Snowy R2-D2, I got that in app and calendar, and I just think it looks pretty cool. Um, what is your favorite meme? That's an interesting question. I don't think I have a particular genre or favorite meme that I like, but I just put one in here for you guys because I think it's pretty funny. When you can't find the honey, impossible, perhaps the hives are incomplete. Uh, maybe no one else finds that funny, but personally I just really like that one. And the last one's not really a question, but it says say hello, so uh, hello, Green Ninja. Um, next we have the same question from J-Rod Productions and Bricks to You. And they say, what is your favorite clone trooper? And personally, I just have to go with Fives, because I just really liked him when I was watching the Clone Wars back in the day, and he's just, like, the coolest ever. Um, next we have a question from Corporal Bodhi, who says, uh, what is your opinion on Bomb Squad troopers? Um, I don't really know what to go off of to base my opinion on them, because they only had really the one spotlight episode with the Blue Shadow Virus. But I think they're pretty cool. They did their job pretty well. And uh, I guess that's all I have to say about them. Um, awesome Stud Toast says, How did you get so many subscribers? And also, you are awesome. Well, first of all, thank you. Um, I didn't really do anything specifically 
to get as many subscribers as I have. I just kind of posted content, you know, that I enjoyed making that I that I would personally watch, and uh, I just did that, and then other people happened to like it. So that's basically what happened. Um, did you ever want to start doing mocks all these Legos? That comes from ArcTuber80. Um, personally, I've made, I've tried to make mocks before. I've made a few uh, like small scale stuff. So, like my older subscribers will remember my Micro Hoth mock that I made uh, back in the day. And uh, personally, I've considered it. I don't really have like a lot of pieces I can use to make mocks because I like keeping all my sets intact. But I do have a small collection of uh, usable bricks. And uh, maybe I'll try making something bigger one day. Obviously, that picture was not made by me. That is way too good for me. And uh, maybe if I had some more practice, I could make something cool. But I don't know. We'll see uh, in the future what happens. Uh, Anakin Skywalker 501 uh, wants to know what my favorite clone commander is. And uh, I'm going to go with a captain here. I don't know if that's allowed, but I'm going to do it anyway. Uh, so I'm going to say Captain Rex for that one. Red Panda NZ wants to know if he can have a cookie, please. And I'm gonna say yes. Um, I don't think I can give you a cookie because I don't know who you are or where you live. But if you were looking for my permission, then yeah, go ahead and uh, get yourself a cookie three months later. Um, <clears throat> Attendant Blade wants to know what my favorite CAC minifigure is. And that's kind of hard because there's over like 200. Um, and I don't know if he means out of the ones I have or out of the ones, like all of them. So I'm just gonna go with the one I want to get next, which is the uh, Battlefront 2 uh, Rocket Trooper, because I just think that one's so cool, and I really uh, want to add that one to my collection as soon as I can. Uh, Rubman, Rubman T, Rubman T. I don't know how you say that. Um, asks, what is your favorite discontinued Lego series? And that is obviously for me, Exo Force. If you guys are longtime LEGO fans, then you'll know that Exo Force was super cool. It was basically about how these uh, humans made these mechs and they fought these uh, little robot guys. And I have about uh, half a dozen sets from that series, and so it's just uh, my favorite. If they brought it back, I would be ecstatic about that because I just love it so much. And uh, LEGO Guy wants to know what is my favorite LEGO set, and the picture right there is the V19 Torrent. Um, it's not like a particularly, uh, you know, like, cool set, like it doesn't have a lot of minifigures in it, but for me it just has a, a lot of personal value because it was one of the first LEGO sets that I got, and I just think it's so cool the way the wings fold up and it's just a really cool set to, you know, fly around and have fun with. And then do I have any pets? Uh, yes, I have a dog and a cat, I don't see what that has to do with anything, but there you go. And then he says, what else do you do besides LEGO? And I'm just gonna go with the, you know, normal teenage stuff, uh, video games, TV, sports, you know, all that good stuff. Alright guys, that's all the questions that we have time for today. And uh, like I said before, thank you guys for bearing with me over this uh, three month break that I had to take. I really didn't want to, but it's just something I kinda had to do, I had to I have to get a new computer. And so thank all you guys for uh, sticking with me, and I uh, hope you guys will stick around for all the awesome new content I have planned for the summer. Uh, so uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, have a nice day.